All right, good morning, uh, good afternoon, good evening, Tragic Life, and we're back with Final Fantasy for the after years. Um, I'm going to try to get this about a month ahead. Um, this and uh, the Pokemon Yellow, I just uploaded last night uh, my first two NFL football or Madden 24 games. I'm still working out some kinks with the realism uh, sliders, but we're getting there. Um, the second game looked much better than the first. Um, I'm going to do the entire season. That's the goal. Um, I'm going to try to get as in as close to the actual game as possible. Um, and then after the season, I may start... I might create a, a fantasy football world. We'll see. Uh, got some big ideas. I don't know what to happen with them. Uh, but until then, we're going to go ahead and continue our normal gaming with uh, Radio's Tale here. Peaceful days have finally returned to our homeland. We have taken up the goals you strove for in life. I only hope that we have received your blessings. Rydia. What's the matter, Rydia? I thought you were supposed to be in the Fae March. Edward. My least favorite character. How long has it been, Rydia? I'm so glad to see you. Well... What brings you here today? Just trying to do what I can to revive the fortune of this village. But doesn't Demacian have it hard enough right now? Don't worry, Demacian has many citizens to help aid in its reconstruction. Those of us with power like Cecil and I must think about more than just our own land. We worry over the fate of villages like Mist too. Cecil too? Your young highness. Where might you be going? Just for a little training session. I have heard that many of Eblon's great treasures are being sold for profit. And why not? What's wrong with using Eblon's treasure to help with Eblon's recovery? I can see, I can only hope that proves to be the case, your young highness. Anyways, I'm off. Of course. I worry that Fabul is providing vast shipments of vital resources too. Even Yang? It was all thanks to your help, Rita, that we all made it through the last war. Ah, don't be silly. Everyone helped each other back then. Calm down, Sid. I can't believe you're taking this so lightly, Cecil. She's been at it for half a day now. Is it over yet? Rydia. Here for the big day, huh? Has the baby been born? Well... Uh, sounds like it. It's a healthy baby boy. You did us proud, Rosa. Thank you, Rosa. Huh. I mean, you had half of a job there, Cecil. So does he have a name? Yes, we've already picked one. Oh, what'd you decide on? Theodore. Hmm, I like it. Nice to meet you, Theodore. Sipping coffee, it may be loud. So good. Cool. 
Radia! Hey, where's Radia? <laughs> She's not visiting her other homeland though. She doesn't make it there often any longer. Her other homeland? Yes, the Fame March. Your Majesty. Oh, Rydia, my child, much time has passed since we last met. Why are you here? Have I not made it clear enough? You are not welcome here in the Bay March anymore. I, I'm sorry. I just wanted to see everyone. Then you have seen us. Now it is time for you to leave. In case you forgot, you are not a citizen of the Fame March, Rydia. But... Can I at least come back to visit every now and then? You won't even let me do that. We cannot. Rydia is like a child. It was surely it wouldn't hurt to let her come by. What is it? No, my dear Rydia, you must leave here at once. What? Why all of a sudden? There is nothing to fear. I'm gonna, not going to do the joke. I've done it before. What do you want? Your power. I am here to take it. We'll see about that. Muhammad is already under our control. Who is our? The hollow father of the Eidolons? Who are you? Yeah, who are you? We have a lot of questions. We have no answers. We need answers. The Eidolons shackled. just happened snap out of it are you all right oh no he's been completely petrified who would do something like this like I'm always afraid to move so, because I might miss a uh, comment or something all right so let me get, check grab that potion but let me check settings as well we need to have battle mode active and dash needs to be on. Alright, that'll make things better. So, should be two potions. Go into town. We're gonna go... I think it's this one. Nope. Might be this one. Yep, and come down here. Got a lot of reading. Asura, Queen of the Fade March. Wife and gateway to the Eidolon King, leader of the Fey March. Only those who wield the same powers as her may see the king in person. The Eidolon King. The proud and seemingly invincible leader of the Fey March, master of the northern oceans that are said to be his birthplace. Odin, legendary master of the fame, Zantetsukin. His only loss in battle occurred when lightning struck the massive sword. The Sylphs. Those light and gentle Eidolons, only when they pull their forces as one does the full potential of their power become apparent. The golden rule of the Fame March, strength lies in just a heart. One shall not acquire power unless one's inner strength is fully realized. Sounds like Jedi's. The two moons. It is said that there was only one moon in the long gone day of the Yor. Bahamut, he whose power transcends that of the Eidolon King. 
From afar, he constantly watches over the eidolons he created. If anyone ever manages to defeat the Invincible Bahamut in battle, it will have been done only by turning his unfathomable power against him. That does help. Reflect definitely helped. Uh, once a great whale from the moon came here to visit. It now rests inside a dragon sleeping in peace. Well, that's information. Eidolons, monsters, humans. Where did they come from and where are they going? It is an eternal mystery. And then last thing, go ahead and click this one. All right. Rydia, why did you return? I'm sorry, Rydia. You should be in the land of the humans, not here. Yeah, we get a cutscene. Your Majesty, Your Highness. This is all my fault. I came back here despite your warnings, and now look what I've, look what at what I've caused. That's from the start of the first, the actual Final Fantasy IV. Goodbye, town. It wasn't this pretty, though, if I remember correctly. I'd have to rewatch it, but I don't think it was. <sighs> no more. I don't want to lose anyone else anymore. Never again. <clears throat> okay, so we're done here. Um, at this point... Uh, we just gotta go back, which I think, there it is, wait, so before going up, make sure you come down here and get the either, uh, we can go around, tent, and Phoenix down, now, come up here, Ice Rod, Dry Either, High Potion, and a 500 Gill. Um, although the Ice Rod is weaker, uh, it does give us more intelligence, which works better for us because I think we're summoners. I'm not sure. I might, for the moment, ignore that. The guide says to equip it, but you lose, so I don't know yet. Yeah, and then boost your intelligence a bit. Uh, I didn't read it, sorry. I need to tell everyone about this as quickly as I can. Okay. Come up here. Either. Potion. Page down, 500 gill. Tent. Another potion. Oh, first bite. Double void. Monsters. Summon. No Eidolons appeared. No. They aren't even answering me. So if you fight these goblins enough, uh, they'll drop the go goblin summon. Um, however, I'm not chasing it this time because it's really not worth it. Okay. Hang on, my dear Eidolons, I promise that I'll save every one of you. I know. Alright, so we're gonna come here first. New moon, waxing moon. Alright, so what does that mean? What does that mean? Uh, okay, white magic is up, black magic is down. 
All right, so we're gonna go ahead and listen to the guide. We're gonna go Ice Rod and we're gonna cast magic in these fights, okay? Okay, so there should be some treasures here. Oh. <clears throat> Well, this is not fun. We're gonna hit them all with lightning. Black magic. Do you guys mind? Can you guys stop? I mean, that works. I'm gonna go north first and grab the eye drops. All right, oh, it's four goblins. All right, I got a bronze hourglass. What does that do? I forgot. It's been a while. Stop. Okay. So the coco ore is something special just to her. either and a decoy what is a decoy I mean it sounds like uh, something okay so it, it cast blank which is good Luca the Falcon's gone too where did they go I can't do anything. Cannon flare from above. Goodbye. Luca. Haha, <laughs> looks like you could use a favor right about now, Radio. Where did you come from? I was so bored that I went to make a few engine improvements. I'm just testing them out now. Master Sid's going to give me a full engineer's license once he sets his eyes on this. That's great, Luca, but what about the crystal in the Dwarven Castle? Is it safe? The crystal. What's that about all of a sudden? We have trouble, Luca. I knew something was up. Oh, what do you mean? I said I was out on a test flight, but that's not the only reason I'm here. Something's definitely up. You can tell from how the number of monsters suddenly multiplied out of nowhere. So I thought it'd be a good idea for me to take the Falcon out on a patrol. I'm impressed your father allowed you to do that. Ah, uh, he doesn't really know about it. <laughs> yeah, getting him to let me be an engineer's apprentice was painful enough. That sounds more like the King's Giat. I know, I'll say that much. Oh no! Was that the Red Wings? Hurry! Get on, Rydia! Okay, we're gonna do a little bit of the castle, not much. 
left first, come in here, check the bottle near the, where is it you? Found 500 more gold. Alright, so, move. Alright, let's go ahead and buy 16 of these. Um, we're gonna buy, that's too many. Eight of these. By ten of these, because silence is deadly to um, our main character here. Um, now we're broke. What do you sell? Do you sell anything good? You are that. Okay. Yeah. Um. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, because we don't have a white mate, so Phoenix Downs are all important. Um, come my way, buddy. Okay, so we go to the infirmary. Okay. I think it's this one. Yep, Coco Ore. That's something only her character can find. Go ahead and talk to this guy. Lolly Hall, we aren't using the base right now. Don't think about the base. Chester Biddle, and that's not cool. These have not been. Phoenix down, tent, Bacchus wine, yes. Okay. First things first, want right this one. Got another cocoa ore. Good. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, so there should be two more chests in here. Let's see. Okay. It says back in the room we came from, so we gotta go pretty far back. Got it. I got. I understand. I understand what it's cooking now. Probably right here. Oh. Okay, we got a potion, potion, and orders closed. See, I just want to see what you guys are selling. Ah, I mean, that's nice. That's the only nice thing you're selling at the moment. All right. Ah. So, yeah. So, 1,600. 2,200 is what I need. I have 100. Okay. Okay, should be a high potion, climb the stairs, inspect the armor for another cocoa ore. Alright, we got 600 gil, that's cool. Alright, tunic down. Either. How do I do this? Silver apple and iron shield. So there goes a thousand that I don't need. OK. 
Okay, well, there's that. Silver Apple, max HP. You're very low, so it's gonna be you. Alright. Back on the first floor of the tire, go out the door and walk to the left. Okay. I think that was it. That was a da 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 bomb crane. So these are harder to explain how to get, you just gotta kinda walk it. What do you got? Potion. And Hermes sandal. Anything else? Let me out. Alright, so that's it. I'm just going to get us in position to do the next part, and then I'm going to cut off the video, yo. So we're going to stop right here. So until next time, adios amigos. Uh, keep watching my videos, like, subscribe, you know, the whole thing. Comment. Let me know what y'all think. Um, adios amigos.